Hey, this is Paul from Wondershare Mobile Trans. And on this channel, you can get tips and reviews of some of the latest phones. On one of our other videos, we received this comment from someone and what they said was that last time they synced their phone, what had happened was that all of their iPhone contacts had been deleted on their new phone, but all those contacts were still available on their old phone. And what they wanted to know is how they can transfer their contacts from one iPhone to a new iPhone. And if you've had this problem as well, then don't worry because today in this video, I will teach you how you can transfer your contacts from one iPhone to another iPhone. The first method for this is using our good old friend, Mobile Trans. And if that is something that you wanna do, then all you need to do is follow these next steps. First of all, if you don't have the Mobile Trans software, then you need to go and download it. And if you want to do that then there is a link in the description to where you need to go after you've installed it all you need to do then is open that mobile trans software and make sure that both your iPhones are connected to the computer and then that last method is to make sure that your source and your destination device are the correct devices and then all you have to do is click start and it is that simple. Your contacts will now have transferred from your old iPhone to your new iPhone. So the second method is to use what Apple offer and you can use iCloud. This is one of those other ways that you can actually transfer your contacts from one of your iPhones to another. And I don't know if you know this already, but iCloud with contacts lets you upload your contacts to iCloud using Wi-Fi or mobile data and means that then once you sign in with your Apple ID on another device, they are there ready for you to use. And the best thing about this means that you can transfer your contacts from an old iPhone to a new iPhone really easily and you can do it without a computer. So let me tell you how you can do it. First of all, tap on your iPhone settings and then you'll see at the top there, there is an option to have a look at iCloud. Then go and scroll through until you see that contacts option. And if that contacts option is off, switch it on and that will start uploading your contacts automatically that you have saved in your phone up to iCloud. Once your contacts have uploaded to the iCloud server, then you need to go and grab your brand new iPhone and go into settings and then go over and click on iCloud. Click on contacts and make sure that is switched on again. And as soon as you switch that on in your iCloud on your new iPhone, your contacts will automatically sync over and it is easy as that. Right, let's have a look at method three. And if you're worried about trying to back up your contacts to any of these other methods and you still wanna do it the old school way, then you can do because you can still do this using iTunes. Using iTunes lets you back up your contacts and other data to your computer and then means that when you get a new iPhone, you can plug that into your computer and you can take all of that data from one one iPhone to the new iPhone and it's Apple's official way of doing it. Before I start walking you through all the methods on how to do it, just make sure you have iTunes installed, of course, and also make sure it is up to date on the latest iTunes software. Okay, so now once you've got the iTunes software installed, all you need to do is open up iTunes, then connect your old iPhone first of all, and then you'll see it pop up on the left-hand side of the screen. Once your iPhone is then connected, click on the summary option, and then this is where you see the option to back up your old iPhone to your computer. Now, let's make sure that backup process has actually been successfully completed. So what you need to do here is go into preferences and then click on device. Here you'll see a date and time when you have created that backup, and you'll also see a device name. So if you see your old device name in this list, that just means that your backup has been completed successfully. Now, let's turn on that new iPhone that you would have and connect it with your computer and iTunes. And if you have any data on this phone at this point, just make sure that you wipe it. After you've restored your old data at this point, make sure you turn your phone off and on again by following those on-screen instructions. Then you'll see an apps and data option. Now here, what you need to do is tap on restore from iTunes backup. Then just tap next and it will connect your new phone to your computer where your old backup is saved. Now select your device and click on that restore backup from that summary tab that we've talked about earlier on. Select on that backup that you've restored previously, click okay, and then give the iPhone a couple of minutes and then it will have all of the data on it 
that you wanted to move across to your new iPhone. There we go, there's three methods that have helped you move your contacts from an old iPhone to a new iPhone. And if it helped you move your contacts over, then why not give the video a like? And if it did really help you out, then why not subscribe to the channel as well? Because we give you tips and we give you reviews of some new mobile phones, which you'll see in the next couple of months. So. Thank you very much for watching and then we can see you on the next video.